So we continue here by uh, since we have an exercise, and we continue. Sub question B. Okay. Sub question. Sub question B. The map has a scale of one to fifty thousand. So on the map, a footpath is twenty centimeter long. Okay. We try to find the length in kilometers of the footpath in a real life. Okay, first of all, we have 12 centimeters. One, two, 12 centimeters. Okay? We convert this to kilometers using this scale. So we just multiply 12 by what? By 15,000. So 12. Multiply by 15,000. Give us what? Give us 600,000 centimeters. 600,000 600, centimeters. I wanted to convert it to kilometer. First of all, the first step here we multiply by the scale to get the real life distance in centimeters. Okay, then we should divide this by 100 to convert to what? To convert to centimeter, to, to convert from centimeter to meter. Okay, so I will divide this 600,000. Okay, 600,000 divided by what? Divided by, by 100 gives what? Gives 6,000 what? 6,000 meters. Now, from meter I can convert it to kilometer. Why? Because 1 kilometer is equal to 1,000 meters. So, this one I will divide this by what? I will divide by 1,000 to convert from meter to 2 kilometers. So I will divide, it will be 6,000 divided by, by 1,000. Give us 6 kilometers. Okay? So we see the length in kilometers of the path, of the foot path in real life. Okay? There is another method also. For example, if we can use another method, we just made okay, 12 centimeter divided 12 centimeter divided by by x in kilometer. Equal what? Equal one divided by fifteen thousand. So we call that we call twelve divided by x to be equal to one divided by fifteen thousand. Okay? Then make cross multiply. We make 12 multiplied by 15,000. Gives x by 1 is x. So, minus x equal 12 multiplied by, by 15,000. Okay? It will be equal to 600,000. Okay, the unit centimeter. This is the unit of x in kilometer. Okay? I will. I will divide 600 kilometer by to convert to meter. I will divide by 100. So I will just make x equal. So it will be 6,000. Okay, 6,000 meter because I will divide this. I will divide this by 100 to convert from centimeter to to meter. So it will be x equals 600 meters. 
then I will divide by what? By 1000, okay? To get to the sub x equal x equal 6 kilometers. Okay? The next. Now we have a map has a scale of 1 to 50,000. In real life, a road is 24 kilometers. I will try to convert to centimeters. Okay? Whatever length in centimeters of the road on the map. Okay. So I will make what? First of all, I will multiply the real life distance. The real life distance. Okay, by 1000 means 24 kilometer multiplied by 1000 gives 24,000 meter. Okay, why? Because I will convert from kilometer to meter. Okay, so in order to convert from kilometer to meter, you should multiply by you should multiply by 1000. Okay, multiply by 1000. Then, as we thought, now multiply 24,000 meter by 100 to convert from meter to centimeter. Okay? So 24,000 multiplied by 100 gives us, give us, okay, gives us 2 million and 400 centimeters. Okay? Then, to convert now, from uh, from uh, okay from from centimeter equal forty yes okay then as we found twenty four meter multiplied by one hundred gives two million and four hundred thousand meter okay now divide the scale to get divide by the scale to get divide by fifty thousand to get the distance on the map in centimeters. So this one, it will be what? It will be 2,400,000 divided by, by 50,000 gives 48 centimeters. Okay? Gives 48 centimeters. That is the length in centimeters of the road on the map. Okay? The next. The ship sails 20 kilometers northeast. Northeast, then 18 kilometer S, and then stop. Okay, this is no, no, okay. Question How far it is from its starting point when it stopped? Okay, then on what bearing must it say to return to its starting point? This is the bearing of. The return bearing. This is B. This is O. This is A. The turn, the turn, the turn bearing is that. Bearing is that. Okay. So, first of all, note that the path of the sheep can be drawn using the scale of one centimeter for two every for two every kilometer. Okay. For one centimeter to equal two kilometers. So the distance, small a, the distance of B O is what? You can use it with your uh, uh, your ruler and you will find it as seven point seven point three, okay, seven point three centimeter, which is equal to what? Two. Multiply this by two will be fourteen equal fourteen point six kilometers. Okay, equal fourteen point six kilometers because one centimeter represents represents two kilometers. Means one centimeter is equal to two kilometers. And here we have seven point three. Use your ruler. We use if you will use your ruler, it will be seven point three centimeter. Multiply this to change to turn back to your scale of the road. So, the distance VO can be measured on the diagram as 7.3 centimeter. Okay? 
And you know that one centimeter equal two kilometers, isn't it? So change this two kilometer. Just multiply one centimeter, multiply by this is multiply this by seven point three, and this is by seven point three. Okay. It will be seven. It will be seven point three centimeter equal seven point three multiply by by two gives fourteen point six kilometer. This is in the sense OB, RB. Okay, we told that the distance view can be measured on the diagram as 7.3 cm, which represents, which represents, which represents, okay, an actual distance of 14.6 km. Now let's move to the bank, to the bank of, of who, from, from what, from, of who, I guess like this, because I read. Use it. Okay, this is we call seven point three centimeter. Okay, which is equal to fourteen point fourteen point six kilo. Okay, then now we try to find the band of O from B or the band uh, from B to O. So, this is my thing is 180 degrees. This one is 180 degrees. Why? Because it's a line. And also, this is a line. So, this angle plus this angle should be, should add up to 180 degrees. I mean, this is 75 plus 1 gives us 180, gives us 105. 105 degrees. So the bearing of O from B is what? It's 180 plus 105. So it will be 180 plus, plus 105 degrees. Equal what? Equal 285 degrees. Okay, so here you will just find this angle. This is 180, okay, it's clean, but this one, this is a line, so angle is on a line, add up 180. 75 plus x equal 180, so x equal 180 minus 75. Okay, I will try to do this one. If this is, you label as x, okay, this angle, only this one, only this one, label as x, okay, it will be x. Plus 75 degree equal 180 degree. So subtract here 75 and here 75. So it will be 105 degree equal what? Equal x. So means what it is? Means that this angle, this angle, this angle, only this is 105. The bearing, the bearing of O from B is 180 plus 105 means all of this. We measure all this angle, okay? Not clockwise, okay? Direction. Then, so the bearing of O from B can be measured as 285. Remember to always put the scale on the table, okay? You see the scale on the table. Okay. If you make here a scale, for example, this is 20 km and this is 18 km, you will just make, okay, make 1 cm equal, for example, 2 km. And this scale, you should write it on the top. Okay? The next. Morat works 750 meter. Okay, on a bearing of zero point of 30 degree. Okay, this is the point O. This is the north direction. This is the north direction. 
this one, this one is the point B, and this one is the C three hundred and fifty, and this one is the point A. This one is the point A. Okay. And the scalar factor is what? The scalar factor is one centimeter equal one hundred meter. You see the scale, the scale of drawing, sorry, not the scale of Okay, and this one, 750, 750 meter. This angle, this, only this angle, I mean, this angle is, is 76, is 76. This one. Is seventy-six and this one is seventy-four. Seventy-four degree. This angle, okay. And this one is thirty degree. Thirty degree. Thirty degree. Okay. Now. Okay. We talked about more work. Seven hundred. And 50 meter on the bearing, okay, of 300 of 30, okay. So we see the distance, but the voltage, okay, means the volt 750 meter of a bearing 30 degree. This is clockwise, not direction. I will measure this angle later. Then he then works on a bearing of 350 from the top of this one. I will make north direction and. I will may I will draw the north direction. This is N. Then he will go back. He works what? He works on a bearing of 300 and 300 and 350. All of this is 350. Okay. Until he he is due north of his starting point and start. Okay. How far does he walk on a bearing of 315 degrees? First of all, we should write down the scale of drawing. Okay, we call one centimeter is equal to 100 and to 100 meters. This is your scale of drawing. Okay, for a small a, how far does it does he walk on the bearing of 315 degree? Just calculate the distance AB. What is AB? This is the distance AB. Calculate or measure the distance AB. Okay? The distance, this is equal A. And this one is B. Okay. So, here, uh, the distance AB or the line segment AB can be measured the exact ruler, ruler. Okay? It will be 5.3. 5.3 cm, which represent an actual distance of what? If we would like to convert 5.3, my kids, centimeter to meter, we should multiply by the scale factor. We told that 1 centimeter represent 100 meters. So we should just multiply this by 100 to get, let's say, the uh, distance. It will be 530 what? And 30 meters. Why? Because we use what? We use the scale of draw. Small b, how far is Murad from his starting point when he stopped? When he stopped. So we just, this is 750. If you would like to use your, to convert to, to, to centimeter using the scale of draw, it will be 5.7.5 centimeters. Okay? Why? Because 1 centimeter is 100 meters. So, 1 multiplied by 7.5 centimeter equal what? Equal 7.5 centimeter multiplied by 100. Here is 750. And this one we call 5 point... 5 point what? The distance AB you can create is 5.3 centimeter. Is equal as meter, we will use the scale of drawing, it will be 530 meters. Ok? 
Okay? You can write also five values that have to me. Okay? Then, now the question is what? Like, find the distance of the line segment OB. Okay? You will use your ruler. Okay? And it is, uh, the, the, the distance OB can be measured as 10.2. 10 10.2 10 centimeter. Can you use your scale of drawing and change it to meter? It will be 1000 and 20 meter. Okay, this is the distance OB. So the distance OB can be measured as 10.2 centimeter. This one is representing an actual distance, an actual distance of 1020 meter. Okay? Thank you for listening. See you next time. Goodbye.